First tonight, an exclusive update on a Columbus nightclub after a shooting there over the weekend. As News 3 has reported, gunshots were fired around 2 a.m. Sunday at Club Medallion on Midtown Drive. Two men were shot. No arrests have been made so far. Now the city is looking into the club's crime history. But as News 3's Alex Durrence tells us, they won't need to look into it any further. He has an update you'll hear only on News 3. Phil, I spoke with the owner of Club Medallion today. He tells me he has decided to permanently close the nightclub. I also spoke with Mayor Teresa Tomlinson, who learned about the owner's decision from News 3. Locks currently sit on the doors of Club Medallion. These locks will be there permanently as the club's owner decided Tuesday to shut it down. Owner Tyrone Tuke says this past weekend's incident was the nail in the coffin. He says he does not promote or tolerate violence. I can't go any longer. I don't have the energy and I don't have the, the, the time to be sitting in a courtroom explaining or explaining to someone's parent what happened to uh, their, their, their son or daughter or, you know, what the case may be. Uh, I got to do what I got to do. I got to shut it down. Took says in his three plus years of owning the club, there have been occasional fights at the club, but never to the scale of this past weekend. Mayor Teresa Tomlinson hates it for Tooks and thinks the city would have assessed the history of the club to see if this was an isolated incident or something that occurred more often. When you bring your risk based life to that club, you are putting that individual's livelihood at stake, and you also are um, jeopardizing uh, the community atmosphere and good time uh, that other people who go to that establishment. Um, um, like to enjoy. By me shutting this facility down, this, uh, this, this business down, this club down, does it stop? That's the question. How does it stop? Or will it stop? I don't think so. Is it going to move to another location? It's not the club, it's not the business, it's not the owner, it's the people that comes to the, the, the business. Alex joining me now. So, so what's the next step for the owner? Well, Tukes told me this morning he paid a visit to the Department of Revenue Division office here in Columbus and began the process of pulling the business license. And he says if he does decide to open up another club, it will be for folks 25 and older, and there will also be a dress code at that club. All right. We'll stay on top of it. Thanks so much, Alex, for that story tonight.